Varadaro, Cuba. We are out here today renting the bikes on another beautiful day in Cuba as you guys can see. Beautiful, beautiful morning. There's Mike. We had such a good time last time as you guys seen in the previous vlog. So this time we got it for 24 hours. So excited to bring you guys along with the journey. Mike, what are you doing? Look at Mike thinks he's super cool with these glasses. You think you're cool with the glasses or what? Yeah, yeah. I don't cry this time. Yeah. Yeah, I know, last time when we were on the bikes, literally you're like this, and your freaking shirts are like that, it's just waving back and forth. Oh, look at that car right in front of the palm trees. That's sick, that's a Cuba shot right there. That's a Cuba shot. If you guys are new here, make sure to go down below, smash that subscribe button, make sure to leave a big thumbs up for your boy, because it's gonna be a live like, hey, where are you going? You gotta test it out to make sure it works, Mike. <laughs> My man. Should be a fun day. Oh, he's gotta pump it up a little bit. Oh, air. Gotta get the air. Oh, yeah. Give it. Dude, you have to make sure you got the full blasted air in the tire. Come on. Hey, my friend. My friend. Mike, why do you think you're super cool? You think you think you're super cool doing this? Yeah. Gotta stop and get some gas. It's okay. It's only five bucks. To fill. It's actually a pretty interesting gas station. Like people get lit here. Like they literally, there, there's people that brought up boom boxes and I didn't get in the vlog, but they literally started like freaking going ham. Oh, let's go. Little stop on the side of the highway. The speed limit actually went up to 90, which these bikes actually cap out at 90. We've seen some horses on the side of the road. And Jose, where are you going? Jose, come back. You can see like, you can tell that there's so much different architecture when you drive further away from Vedadado, because I'm pretty sure, I don't know if we're still in Vedadado, but we might be. Okay. It's things that you've never seen before, right? It's so much different, but it's really cool to check out. I need to get a tan, man. I'm white. What the heck is that? Is that an ox? Dude, I think that's an ox. Why is it the only one? You guys see that? Right there. That's a big sculptured crab. We're trying to figure out how to get on that side of the road now because we're kind of in a one-way zone and we can't turn around. So we don't really know exactly how to get on the other side. I think if we just cut across, it'll be easier. Okay, so we pulled over a little bit and this is literally just a fire being burnt. Like just a, a forest fire. Something being burnt on the side of the highway. We're literally just chilling here. We actually don't know where we are, but we're just hanging out. And we pulled over and this is what we see. Just stuff burning. And they're not even, it's not, they're not even doing anything about it. It's just burning. I don't think they know exactly what's going on or they do and this is just normal in Cuba. So much different than Canada, it's absolutely insane. It's beautiful though, like the more you keep going further past Vedadero, it kind of gets a little bit more, it looks a little bit more run down. But overall, very beautiful. Oh, there's kids, hi kids. I think we just found an abandoned ballpark. I can't believe how hot it is. Dude, it's scorcher. How are you wearing a sweater and pants? Like, are you serious? It's probably upwards of 85 degrees right now. That's not, that's not a nice beach. Holy crap, it's hot. That's very muddy. What is that? Oh, rock face. Blood rock. There's a swamp right there. I think your alligators are in there. This reminds me of something from The Lion King, like a, like a den of some sort. As you can see in the ground right there, these are probably the biggest pineapples you'll ever see. Okay guys, so we ended up making another stop in a little 
subdivision, corner street in Vetadato. Just parked the bikes right here. We've seen a couple of really cool pink taxi cars. These are literally notorious in Cuba. I'm telling you, these are freaking amazing. And like, you just got, you got to pull over and check them out. And I think these are like little souvenir shops. So I'm going to go check it out. I'm going to get some souvenirs for the family, for my lovely girlfriend. Ooh. These are sweet, look at these. The different types of thing that these people make is insane, dude. Look at all this stuff. It's all handmade. Yeah, they got like all this stuff right here is all handmade. It's insane. Bracelets, earrings, rings, necklaces, all kinds of purses. Hats, got sandals. Hola. That's that's pretty cool. I like that. I could use that every day. It's just in the wind. Wow. Everything looks like it's made out of leather here. It's like so many different cool things to see. You see all that? Look at all this. So many cool different things to see. It's all handmade, everything. Look at these hats. It's made out of like, like literally leather. Everything. Stuff to hold your cigar. Do one bottle of rum or lighter. There you go. Lighter yeah. holders. Need some rum? Get some rum. One shot. One shot the rum. Need some new wallet. Oh, this is to hold your bottle. What? What was kitty? Oh my god, young kitty, what are you guys doing? Mike decided he wanted to do an a la carte dinner, which I had no idea what it was. Speak for yourself, Mike. Romantic dinner for two. <laughs> Will you join me tonight, Chris? <laughs> Will you have the honors, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> we got a show to come with it, too. You look at that. We got a nice show. Cheers. Oh, cheers, Mike. Cheers. Oh, no, you didn't oh, cheers it. You didn't cheers it. Cheers. Nice. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my appetizer. I ordered a chicken pineapple with sweet wine dish. This is just an appetizer. Look, look what it looks like, guys. It's so small. So it was actually really good. And uh, this pork. is the entree. So this is like a sweet pork filet mignon. Uh, I think that's mashed potatoes. A little bit of vegetables. And Chicken leg beef. Yeah, what'd you get, Mike? I got potatoes on mash. It looks the same. It does, but mine's actually beef. It's it beefy. Good? good? Mm hmm Let me try. Let me try first bite of the mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Oh, oh no, I just spilled. Gee, no, what the heck? Cheers. Okay. Ooh. Alyssa's potatoes are better. Dessert time. So me and my Mike got a splatter of whipped cream with like a bunch of different colors. banana flavor. Food coloring on it. She oh, said. Yeah. She said we have a a, a mousse. What was yeah. it? Was it what? It was a, it was banana mousse, banana pie, and flip. I ended up getting a banana pie with a colored dye all over it. Like normal flavor too. It's not even banana. Oh hell no. That's the car wash. We deserve from the buffet. You could have had unlimited that. Dude. Okay, so there was a dessert from the buffet. It tastes like car wash. This is exactly it. I think they just took it from there. But with that being said, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys did enjoy. We ended up going for another little mini bike ride. About, I would say about like 30 minutes. It wasn't too long because we wanted to catch the sunset in a different location. But unfortunately, again, 
the clouds were covering the sun and it looked like there was some lightning. So. 110 to get there in a hurry and we couldn't even do it. Yeah, literally, we're traveling 110, the speed limit's 80. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. Let's, Let's just get say. Arrested. Yeah. In Cuba, that's the title. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to smash that subscribe button if you guys are new. Make sure to leave a big thumbs up and stay tuned for the next vlog. Peace out, family. Stay fit, stay blessed, and have a great rest of your night.